Hello everyone, before we start this video, a quick fundraiser appeal for a unit in Ukraine who are raising money for a Volkswagen T5 minibus for transport duties, as the ones they are using keep breaking down. This is a group we've raised money for in the past for night vision equipment and navigation devices. Any help would be greatly appreciated. So, another day, and another drone strike, and another example of Russia's leaky air defence network. This time the target for the drones is another oil refinery in Krasnodar. The attack took place around 3am local time, and as you can see in these videos, the drone clearly hit its target and caused a pretty substantial blaze. This here is the oil depot that was hit. It was a different site than the one that was hit twice a few weeks ago, being a little bit further east. Vuladar is about the closest point of Ukrainian controlled territory to this region of Krasnodar and that's nearly 350 kilometers away. So these drones flew over quite a substantial distance to reach this oil refinery. Not to mention, if this was indeed the route taken, they'd have had to have flown past Yeysk, which is home to an air base of Russia's, and which you would expect to be pretty well defended. Of course, they may have launched from different areas, Zaporizhia or Odessa for instance. But regardless of the launch point for these drones, to reach the target in Krasnodar, they certainly flew over Russian-occupied territory and a part of Russia itself, exposing the fact that there are still some pretty big holes in Russia's SAM network. So, that's it for this video. We don't have too much information yet. I will do an update if we get some. In the meantime, if you could click like and subscribe, I'd appreciate it. Thanks again, and take care everybody.